shoes and coats come off back there. We get up here. All you have to do is take your electronics out of your bag. Here at Dulles International Airport, several lanes in the security area, travelers are being required to remove all electronics bigger than a smartphone and place them in a bin. We're doing this because uh, the threat is real. We know that terrorists are out there targeting the aviation industry. And uh, now is the time to do something like this, to take this measure. We're looking to increase the baseline of aviation security domestically, and this is one of those types of steps. Lisa Farbstein with TSA says this comes with an increased risk of bad people putting explosives into electronics. So if we get a closer look at something like this, with the laptop, somebody was clever enough to artfully conceal an improvised explosive device inside that laptop. And here is an e-reader, and the e-reader, as you can see as well, surely you're not going to have wires, I hope, coming out of your uh, e-reader. But this has also been altered, where the bomb maker removed the back, opened it up, and inserted explosives. You can just see over here, it's, uh, it's been tampered with. And here as well, it looks like an innocent child's toy, nice and colorful. And this also has been tampered with. This is a little harder to see. They removed the bottom and they put in explosives. You can just see a little bit peeking out here. Oh yeah, see the black one here. Dulles, Reagan National and BWI Marshall are all phasing in the additional screening as TSA officers are trained on the measures. So it's not at every lane all the time because all the officers are not yet trained. But as more and more get trained, we'll start expanding this incrementally, lane by lane by lane, until every checkpoint, every lane at, at the checkpoints here and at the uh, checkpoints at airports nationwide. At Dulles International Airport, Mike Marillo, WTOP News.